Today we're going to talk about getting your HRC400 Wi-Fi smart irrigation controller connected and paired with the Beehive Pro app. The first thing you're going to do after having it wired and plugged in is make sure it's in pairing mode. How you'll know that is you'll see the word pair blinking right here on the LCD screen in the front. Now when you first plug it in, it'll go into pairing mode automatically and it'll go away once you have it paired with your smartphone. Now, if you don't pair within the first two hours, you'll have to hit the reset button that's right here on the back panel to get it back into pairing mode. But once you make sure that it's in pairing mode, the first thing you're going to need to do is download the Beehive Pro app from either the Apple App Store or from Google Play and have it downloaded on your smart device to get started. Then you're going to go ahead and get into the Beehive Pro app and set up an account if you don't have one already. So you just click on Create Account. You put in your name, your last name, your email address, confirm your email address, and then a quick password. Okay, then once you've put in that information, you just need to go through the user license agreement, tap accept, and accept. And then from there, you will have created an account, and now you're logged in. So the first thing it's going to ask you is if you'd like to be notified when important things happen, like if there's a rain delay or if your timer is offline, you can tap yes and it will send messages right to your phone through the app. And now you are into the Beehive Pro app. And this will allow you to program everything directly from there. Now once you're logged into your account, this is the screen that you're gonna see walking you through how to pair your device. You're just gonna tap settings in the lower right hand corner, tap devices, and then tap the little plus sign at the top. From there, you're going to say connect device. It's going to ask you what type of beehive device you're connecting, and this is a timer. And now it's going to look for all of the nearby unpaired timers. So you'll see this one, the HRC400, is already visible. So I'll tap that. It's asking, do I want to pair the device? I say pair. And this will go ahead and connect the two to each other. Now that your controller is paired with your account, all of your settings and programs will be stored in the cloud instead of on the device. For more Beehive video tutorials, check out our YouTube channel.